Hey guys, it's Advanced Logic. Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last part, we made through our way through most of the Snowhead Temple, and now we have the boss key. But first, we're gonna be going stray fairy hunting because we only have 11 out of the 15, and this is gonna be a bitch to go through. At least I think it is, anyway. But yes, stray fairy hunting time, and hopefully, I do not have to go through the whole trouble of bringing this thing up again. Yeah, I don't think I have to. Well, not right now, anyway. And oh. Woo! Almost fell off. So I kind of wish I did. Ah, screw it, I think I will. Because we still have to make our way somewhere. Not exactly sure where, but we'll figure it out eventually. Because we still gotta find four more straight fairies. And hopefully this is the right way. And no, it's not. This just leaves me back here. Damn it! Alright, what do I have to do? Come on, man. I can't remember what to do. I know we had to make our way somewhere here. I think I... Oh... Wait. No, wait. What am I thinking? Ah, oh, I can't remember how to go about this. I can't remember where the last straight four straight fairies are at. And... I'm crazy. Ah! But whatever. Let's actually continue onward and hopefully find the last four straight fairies and fight the boss in the same part. I'm hoping we do anyway. So let's actually get the Deku mask that nah, Deku mask on. I am way too tired. I can't speak properly, and I cannot get in the flower properly. There we go. So down the flower we go, and up we jump. Yay! Damn, I'm tired. What am I even talking about anymore? Am I on Earth? Who am I? Who are you? Ah! I don't know. Actually, oh wait, this just leads... Wait, where does this go? Oh, right. So where does... Where can I go from here, then? Huh. I remember we could have gotten here somewhere, but I can't remember where exactly anymore, anyway. I know we can... We have to make our way here somewhere. But where exactly, I do not know. Now, I know there's no more stray fairies here in the main area since the hair isn't shimmering. Definitely none in here. There's a couple missing here. Oh, I remember now. Hey, bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Acrobatic Link will kick your ass. Ah, screw it. <laughs> I ain't got time to mess around with you guys. Anyway, I'm just melting up all the ice in here. How could I have forgotten this? Seriously? Anyway, this is part of the whole puzzle to getting a few a few of the stray fairies. Screw you! And they can dodge it, apparently. BAM! <laughs> Nothing like overkill. Anyway, let's hit this switch down. And I'm guessing that's another stray fairy. Cool. So now we just gotta push that block over there. But this block is a little different from the ones we saw before because it slides across the whole thing, so... Yep, it's an ice... or a block on ice puzzle. You know, where you push it and it goes, like, across wherever the hell there's, like, something you stop it on. But you can actually climb onto it and jump on it. There we go. Oh god. Oh, that was way too close. Alright, 12 down. Three more to go. So what we want to do with this now? Actually, I'm gonna check real quick. I'm gonna have to make heads or tails of this whole situation. Yep, I'm gonna have to push this up, then right, and then up again, because there's a little thing blocking it from doing that. Up again, left, left, up, and then right again. At least I think. And stop slipping, Link. There we go. And hopefully just up and then right again, and we should be good with figuring out this puzzle. There we go. So now we can just make our way up here. And this is where the chest we saw earlier was at. On the other side of this. There it is. And conveniently, the blocks are there too, so... Very good use of the... Holy crap! Damn. This game doesn't fuck around anymore. And now we have 13 down. Good. So we just need two more. 
if I remember correctly, one's at that one room where I couldn't remember where to go from. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Aha! Trying to be sneaky, huh? Well, I am sneak- I am much less sneakier than you may think. Because I have terrorism on my side. Ah! Son of a bitch! Alright, I can't remember how to go across- how to go about this. I'll just destroy stuff for now. And if... No, there's nothing. Crap! Alright, terrorism it is. Nope! Terrorism! Damn it! It's working against me! Terrorism! There it is! Get down here, buddy! Alright, 14 down, and if I remember correctly, the last one is in the room where I can never remember where it's at exactly. Not this one, definitely not here. It's the one where you do the whole Goron Pound thing. That I remember. Yep, right here! Somewhere in here is the last stray fairy. And I can never remember where exactly. I know it's not from killing all the enemies in here. Actually, I'm gonna probably have to look around with the... Oh, damn it, now I remember. What you want to do is pull out the Lens of Truth and a bunch of regular arrows. Check it out! Sneaky, sneaky game! Get over here, you! And now we have all the stray fairies. Hey, 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 buddy. Hey! Get back here! Get the hell back here! Hey! Hey! There! Now I can stop wasting my time with this. And now we don't have to waste our time with this puzzle because now we have the fire arrow. But now we have to figure out how to make our way up again. Son of a whore! Uh, Alright, we'll figure out our way somehow. And damn, it's already 2 p.m. in the game. So I'm gonna have to figure my way up somehow. We'll have to make our way to that shortcut room. <coughs> so anyway, as I told you guys, I've been playing Final Fantasy 13 again, and I've actually made my way through a little bit of Chapter 11. Like where I last left off, because when I first bought the game, I played it for like a month up to Chapter 11. And then I just gave up entirely for like the next year or so. You know, ever since Final Fantasy 13 came out. And I found out recently they're making a sequel to that. Just as long as Hope is not in that game. Fuck Hope. Fuck it hard. And fuck him hard, seriously. Your mom willingly chose to, gl to die for you to be, ha to be free, I guess. I don't even know what the whole premise of <laughs> the whole thing is. But, yeah. You know, you're as annoying as Carol, but at least you're not as useless. I'll give you that much hope. Anyway, enough talking about Final Fantasy and a Zelda game. I don't think that's a really good combination of genres. <laughs> you know, unless you consider Zelda 2 to be an RPG, in which case... Why? But whatever. I mean, it is a side-scroller with RPG elements, but it doesn't really make it an RPG in general. You know, unless you're really generalizing it to that extent. But anyway, enough talking about RPGs. Even though this is, in a way, is RPG. Oh, what the hell? I just made my way back here. <laughs> what the hell? I just made a full circle. What the F? Alright, where do I go from here? Do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Seriously, what the hell am I thinking? Oh, I was going to make my way here. Jeez. My practice run? Thank you for not sticking to my head. So I'm going to have to roll my way across this, and hopefully I can do it properly. Here we go. Holy crap, holy crap. Ah! Son of a bitch. Well, now that we have those three fairies, I'm trying to make my way to the boss, but unfortunately, the game's not giving me that privilege. We're already ten minutes into this video, and I have not made it to the boss yet. I'm pretty sure the rest of this video is probably going to consist of the boss. Or at least me starting it anyway. Hopefully. I don't really know. Century just right. And... There we go. Whee! Alright. So now let's make our way across here. Uh, excuse me. Uh, there we go. And the sound's not really 
working right right now. And die, freeze hard. Die, I. I'm gonna land on this first. There we go. Aha! I didn't. Holy crap! Oh crap! Let me. There we go. <laughs> I, was, I thought I was gonna drop down before, before I had the chance to make my way up here. So anyway, now that we have access with the boss key, we've gotten all the straight fairies. Let's make our way to the boss. Let's make our way to the boss, eh? Okay, why the hell did I make that accent? <laughs> Screw it. Oh yeah, and if you just didn't want to use the Goron Pound, you can actually use the fire arrows to destroy all of these. Then again, it's kind of pointless for me because I just lost all my magic. So, yep, I'm gonna have to use the ground, the Goron Punch for this. And now I have my magic back. Good. Though it's kind of useless now because I destroyed all of them with the Goron Punch. That's cool. Oh wait, I'm gonna need the Goron form for this. I don't know why I keep I'm making weird decisions and I... Eh. Go back up, damn it. I wanna get to this boss already. Rolling, 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 rolling. Ah! Alright. I wonder if this. There we go. Some extra magic if we need it. And I just keep punching. Nothing! Boss time! Oh, that was easy! Or was it? We already beat the boss. I'm pretty sure it's dead already, so let's just unfreeze it. Holy crap, he's not dead. It's the mass mechanical monster goats! Oh my god! So what you want to do with this is you either want to wait for him to make a full round, or you can just chase him with the Goron form. They give you plenty of magic, so you don't have to, like, worry about anything. Holy crap! You just have to worry about him zapping you. And rocks that he drops, and all this other crap. Bring it! Bring it, goat! I always pronounce it as God when I was a kid. I'm like, then I realized he's a goat. So I'll just pronounce it as goat. So what you want to do is hit him with your spike form and watch out for the little thing he shoots out as a result because it'll hit you in midair too and it, it don't fuck around. Hey, go, go, get back here. Get back here. There we go. There we go. Oh, God. It's going to be. Oh, it did not. Good. Hey, go. Ah! All right, good. So far, I'm making some pretty damn good. Oh, never mind. <laughs> damn it. Go. If he gets far enough, he's gonna get ready to zap you. So you want to keep up with him. So that way he doesn't have a chance to like turn around and try zapping you with his crazy, crazy mind powers. Ah! Ah, crap. He's gonna get ahead. Get back here. Like you could tell when he's gonna try zapping you. Like if you don't hear any more footsteps. So come on, bring it, go! Bring it! Oh crap, don't bring it! No, don't bring it! Ah! Oh yes, and when he's down like that, you gotta punch him. Bizam! Ass! Alright, good. <laughs> and now he's gonna, I think, just start dropping bombs along with this. And stuff from the ceiling is gonna start dropping. There's gonna be a lot of obstacles that make sure you get interrupted in, like, mid-roll. And it's gonna be kind of annoying. Whee! Get back here. Like, you see him start, like, getting all electrical and stuff? That means he's... Holy crap. Ah, oh, he's down. Down. Stay down. Ass. Man, I love that last little combo attack he does. It's freaking hilarious. Yep, he's dropping bombs now, so he's getting weak. Aha! 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 Oh, crap. Like, he'll drop... And these bombs have a pretty wide radius, so if you're anywhere near them they're gonna, and they blow up, then you're fucked. And he's getting way ahead. Crap, 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 crap. Then he's trying to zap. Screw you, go! Get back here. There we go. And I beat it under time. Good. Bam. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I could have made a whole documentary joke about this, but screw that. 
you know, I could have said something along the lines of, the wild goat tries to outrun its prey, the Goron, or its predator, the Goron. But the Goron always succeeds. And now we have another heart container. <laughs> Alright, so that makes our ninth. Damn! Alright, so let's grab our remains and get the hell out of here. Goat's remains! Just freed the innocent spirit that this dark mass had kept imprisoned within the body of evil goat. 